so before start the actual project explanation i request you please subscribe my channel so you can see on the screen up till now i have uploaded more than 66 video on raspberry pi the raspberry pi with iot that is all this video then also iot with arduino all this video are 26 and recently we started the new series on the pick my controller before that i also cover the project on the python web application so if you want to learn python iot raspberry pi arduino pick from the scratch and from uh, freely then please subscribe my channel please support me and the most important part is whatever the code i have explained whatever the project i have created on this youtube channel all these projects are freely available you no need to pay anything for this project so just if only point is you should watch complete video and you should follow my process so if you want to learn something from the scratch and freely then support me and please subscribe my channel and please click on like button hello friend in today's session we will learn how we can design and develop object detection system project by using raspberry pi so you can see on the screen when it detected as a person when it detected as a human it will detect as a person on the screen also it will detect the different type of object like mobile toothbrush etc so in this video i will tell you how you can design and develop this type of project by using raspberry pi so in this project i have used the yellow library which is very popular library to detect the object so how to install that library in raspberry pi that i will tell you in this video it is very simple and easy project you can easily design and develop this project within 30 minutes if you follow my step so let's start the project uh, please watch the complete video so that you can understand how you can design and develop this project by yourself before start the project it is very important to understand which type of hardware you require for this project so you can see on the screen this is the hardware setup that you need for this project it is very simple setup you need the raspberry pi 4a model or you can use raspberry pi 3b i am using raspberry pi 4 you can use any raspberry pi there is no issue you can use raspberry pi 5 also then one usb camera you need you can see i am using the logi usb camera which directly attached to the raspberry pi here to the usb port okay no need additional setup here just attach the usb camera here you can use the any usb camera there is no issue another point is very important you should use the 128 gb memory card you can see this this memory card you should purchase 128 sandix pro okay 128 gb sandix pro memory card okay and that's it then uh, if you want to give the power to raspberry pi you can use the mobile charger you can directly attach the mobile charger here then this one is hdmi port you can use the mini hdmi to hdmi converter and directly connect this hdmi cable to your tv that's it only okay this is very simple and easy setup you need for this project for copy and paste you need uh, the keypad you can directly connect the keypad to raspberry pi like this usb keypad usb mouse to the raspberry pi directly there is no any additional setting you you should you need to do while connecting the keypad and the mouse to the raspberry pi okay but it is very important you should have the latest raspberry pi os that is raspberry pi 64 bit recommended os so how to install that os in your raspberry pi i already explained in very detail in my previous video the previous video thumbnail you can see on the screen and link given in the description okay once you install the latest 64 bit recommended os into a raspberry pi after watching my video it is very important you should not do any update and upgrade you should not execute any update and upgrade command on that raspberry pi because currently that upgrade and update command facing some issue and after you done the update and upgrade you will not able to install any library into raspberry pi so i request only flash the latest os into raspberry pi and directly jump to this video and whatever the command you require for this project that i will explain in this video okay now let's see the practical demonstration of this project before start the practical demonstration it is very important to understand the limitation of this project as we are using the yolo library which is the already available library for object detection so sometimes it may detect the wrong object that is also possibility another point is we are using the raspberry pi so raspberry pi also having some power limitation perform limitation because of that one you can see some screen lagging okay uh, so there is some to uh, there is some limitation of this project that i want to tell you uh, after that one let's see the practical how it will detect the object or not so first we will uh, you can see on the screen it is detecting as a person uh, clearly 
then after that we can show the mobile phone let's see whether it is detect the mobile phone or not so yeah it is detecting cell phone correctly you can see it is detecting as a cell phone uh, now we can show the toothbrush so whether it is showing the toothbrush or not yeah now it is detecting as a toothbrush correctly how to resolve that limitation that i will explain in the upcoming video in that video we will annotate annotate means we will give the name of this image by ourselves we will uh, train our library uh, so that it will detect the correct object okay animal also it will detect there is no issue you can detect the cat dog etc by this inbuilt library but having some limitation so now i will tell you how to install this library or uh, uh, into raspberry pi and after that in upcoming video we will uh, design our uh, database and we will use this yolo library after that one this project will give more accurate result okay okay now now let's see how to install that library into raspberry pi so first you should install the raspberry pi recommended 64 bit recommended os that i already told you do not update or upgrade Ras raspberry pi do not click on this icon also because it is start updating your raspberry pi then after that you should uh, connect your raspberry pi with the wi-fi from here okay wi-fi should available because whatever the library we are downloading it is from the internet then after that i will provide these two file to you one file is command file second file is uh, our program file okay so open the command file in your raspberry pi okay so once you open the command file your raspberry pi in your raspberry pi you can see there is some command you need to install so you can you can do one by one copy one by one command from here just copy first command like this from here copy this command go to the raspberry pi terminal and here you can see this is the raspberry pi terminal right click here and paste and remove this dot one from here we don't require dot one so command should start with the sudo okay then click on enter once you click on enter then this command will install uh, uh, one by one you can install all this command there is total seven command like this you can install one by one all the command just copy the command go to the terminal and paste the command yeah that's it only then once you install all the command then uh, you have to open the open this raspberry pi program so how to open the raspberry pi program just right click on the here and go to the thony okay uh, before that one you should connect your uh, uh, connect your camera to raspberry pi it is very important you should have the camera to raspberry pi while installing the command before installing the command that time also you should connect your camera to raspberry pi then after that one you just click on this run button wait for some second because it start downloading the library yolo library and uh, pretend model okay so wait for some second okay so once you click on run button you can see is this window will open and start detecting your object it is very simple and easy way to run your project then after that if you want to understand the project it is very easy we are using torch library cv2 library for image processing torch for the object detection for the torch library we are pro providing the yellow pretend model so that's why this li line is here then video capture zero as we are using the usb camera that's why it is zero given here if you are using raspberry pi camera then you can change this uh, zero to minus one minus two one two you can try with different number then it is checking here whether is camera open or not if camera is connected then it will uh, it will go to this line if camera is not connected then it will show this error then after that it show uh, it will run the model and whatever the frame capture from the camera it is given to the model and based on the model inbuilt library it will show the result on the screen by using this line that's it only this is uh, uh, then after that if you want to if you uh, click on the stop window uh, sorry stop button then it will release the camera it is the cv2 library that's it uh, that's it only it is very easy and very simple code okay so i hope you understand the code and how to install the library in the next upcoming video we will uh, use this library in many projects like uh, number plate detection car detection any different types of project and how to annotate uh, the object by ourselves also that we will see in upcoming video so please like please subscribe this channel please support me if you have any comment reach out to me my whatsapp number given in the description mail id given in the description you can download this all this file from my website link website link given in the description thanks for watching this video